Yeah, let's not accidentally go into the uh, death stadium again. Oh, oh, where, where, where? Oh no, that's where. Zero, I'm out of bullets. Gosh, name is here. Shut up, nerd. Well, at least I have a very slow vehicle now. Oh, good, yeah, fight each other. What you doing over there with your baseball bat? That's right. Oh, you're gonna. Oh, oh, wait. <laughs> Jolene don't care. Alright. Bunch of crap I don't care about. Ooh, pipe bomb. Alright, let's see if this guy, uh. I wonder if we can tell him that the guy he hated is dead now, so I could buy some Wi-Fi receivers. Good to see you again. Need something else? You fix my gear, buy some parts. Sorry, I don't really have anything to sell. All right, fix. I'll be... Pair all, 33,000 caps. Eh. All right, seeing as I have no ammo now, I might just leave my tank here. Yeah, yeah I'm, okay. We're, I'm leaving it there because it's just gonna be slow. Ooh, wow, we're gonna level up again pretty soon. Ice pick. I'm gonna be rich. Evans up. Jameson. Already knows just as well as I do how much we can make off this haul, but he's too scared of the Metro monsters to actually go and take it. Well, guess what, Evan? You only get your share if you help out, which means I get everything. Yeah, suck it. It's easy, really. We just gotta pry or blow open the door of the train car before those things in the Metro find. The rest of the note is covered in blood. Dried blood. The most dangerous of the bloods. Yeah, let's watch this out chest breach video. He left his tank uh, screaming at my screen. It's horrible. All right, so we're killing some dude. This is uh, one of the mercenary missions. Shadows Peak Campground. Gay as Plubius, exiled leaves and shoujish. Hello there, Plubius. I am Master Chief. Give me that ship. Ave profligate. You stand before Gaius Publius, centurion to legate Valerius. I grant you this audience. You may speak. Your legion? Was it that hard to figure out? Yes, I was once a proud member of Caesar's Legion, and soon I will be again. So you're not part of the Legion. A slave escaped under my watch. For this, I was exiled. However, once I rectify my mistake, I shall return to Ostia and reclaim my position at the Legate's right hand. Oh nice, Ostia, that's where we have to go. Um, if you're not Legion, who are these guys? So the Legion won't seek retribution for your death? Uh, who are these guys? They are those loyal to me. Those who chose to willingly share in my exile. And so, they shall share my triumph. They won't seek retribution for your death? I suppose not. Why? Do you wish to kill me? Go ahead, face me, and I shall take your head as a trophy. Alright, let's talk about something else. My patience wanes. Profligate. Tell me about yourself. I see little reason to do so, Profligate. Oh, come on. You must have some pretty epic war stories, Grandpa. Oh, yes. 
I joined the Legion at a young age, when my tribe was assimilated. I quickly surpassed my peers and proved myself on the field of battle. I remember one of those battles well. It was the battle that helped Valerius ascend to the title of Legate. As he was protecting Kaiser, I was at the front, face to face with the enemy. The enemy tribe had broken through our line, and I stood alone. Bathed in blood and entrails, I held my ground. Even when my reinforcements fell, I stood proud. Even when my chest was full to bursting with spear tips, I continued to fight until it was won. My perseverance earned me a place in the frontier. What about your faith, though? It is a private matter. I would suggest you tread this topic carefully. I, uh, I'd like to know. Another word, and I cut out your tongue, profligate. Are you Solid Snake? Does your face smell like bacon? I warned you, profligate. Bacon time! Oh wow, nice uh, knives. Headhunter! You wanna check out, you wanna try the, the seat out? Sorry guys. Oh, all your bodies are together now. All right, let's just, there we go, okay. All right, I th thought he may have given us a quest, but it's probably, probably a, a Legion thingy. Uh, someone let me know in the comments. <laughs> Put on your hats and grab your shovels, Junior Explorers. It's time for the annual Shadows Peak Treasure Hunt. Climb the highest peaks, delve into the deepest caves, all in search of glorious booty. Find the treasure resting after a long day's work, but where in town could it find a room for the night? Good luck, Junior Explorers. Don't forget to get back in time for our iconic Sloppy Joe hot dogs. Disclaimer, the Shadows Peak Camp Company does not actually encourage contestants to climb mountains and or enter caves. The Shadows Peak Camp Company is in no way responsible for any harm that results during the treasure hunt. Cookies all around. Oh, that's pretty cool. Cookies all around. Who's got the cookies? Who's got the cook grease? I've got the cook grease. Who's got the cook grease? You got the cook grease. Hey. Do 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 do. Oh, I was supposed to kill you, Marco. You okay? You awake? Yep, that's Marco. To your surprise, Marco was already dead. Judging by the state of the body, Marco's been dead for some time. The police badge mentioned in the bounty is clearly visible on his right shoulder. Take the badge. Turn to Matt Wyatt. Marco's journal. Probably gonna get ambushed. Put your bets in. Idiots thought a cave would work for a base. Thought the dogs wouldn't get out. I'm glad I got out when I did. Another dream tonight. Same thing as always. That kid looking up at me with bloodshot eyes. Then I lower the gun. Watch him run off as his dad screams in the background. <laughs> Some nights I wish I had taken the shot. Some nights I wish I turned the gun on myself. Someone out there. Hiding in the shadows. Just out of sight. I see him in the corner of my eye. I've been on edge since I left. Whatever's coming. It's bad. Ooh. Is it a yeti? Are we going to get attacked by a yeti? That'd be fun. <laughs> I'd, uh, I'd enjoy getting attacked by a yeti. I'd be okay with that. Hey! Another floating Navi thing. Navi, what's up? What's going on, huh? Nothing? Just radiation? That's cool. Oh, okay. Bye-bye. Hey. Hey, dudes. Dude and sir. Beat it, punk. This is Danny's business. What if I'm doing business, huh? Who's Danny? If you don't know Danny, then you're new or you're dumb. Both. He's one of the biggest merchants in Portland, and no one messes with him. No one. Why does he live in this crap hole? Tell me about this woman next to you. She's a scrap collector. But word is, she used to be a salt town miner. 
Maybe if she stayed there, she'd be able to pay Danny back. Oh, I freed Salt Town. So. She She's a scrap collector. Okay, yeah, I know. But word is, she used to be a Salt Town miner. Yeah, scraper. Maybe if she stayed there, she'd be able to pay Danny back. Oh, okay, scraper. If you say. She's a scrap you son of a bitch. What are you gonna do to her? She's made it clear that she's not paying up. So once we get inside, we're going to kill her. Wait, is there another lady somewhere? What does Danny want? A few years ago, the ghoul in there took out a loan from Danny. It's time to collect, but the bitch refuses to pay. I actually just got back from Danny. Uh, Cap's arrived. There's no reason for you to stay here. Um, could I pay off her loan? We'll leave when we get the Caps. Doesn't matter where they come from. Of course, that only works if you got 900 caps on you. Oh, yeah, that's chump change. Here you go. Uh, yeah. That's perfect, actually. Well, guess we're done here. Let's go. See you later, losers. A bunch of idiots. Also, watch out. There's danger in these woods, apparently. Hey there, ma'am. Ugh, thanks for taking care of those idiots for me. Normally I'd be able to take them, but I ran out of shells on the way here. I can't give you anything, but if you're looking for conversation, I'm more than happy to oblige. Tell me about your past. Was that what those guys said true? Do you owe a Danny Caps? Not anymore. I did take a loan out from him when I first left Salt Town, but I paid it back in full. Danny sent his guys here because he thinks I forgot I paid him. Unfortunately for him, being a ghoul doesn't automatically give me Alzheimer's. Uh, well, do you live here? No, those meatheads just cornered me here. I don't live anywhere, really. I just walk the wastes. It's a good life, despite what you may think. I understand completely. I can never stay in one place too long. I can't imagine not having a home to go back to. I think you're a dirty hobo. Yeah, sure, you can you fly around. Ah, fellow traveler. Should have figured from the mud on your boots. Space boots. Nice to know I'm not the only one bumming it on the road. Tell me of your past. We talking before or after my face look like this? The transition. Uh, before, let's do both. Before this, before the war, I was a fire starter. Anarchist is what they called us back then. Guys in charge said all we did was throw bombs at people. That wasn't true of all of us, but I fit the stereotype to a T. Even had a partner, in more ways than one. Italian guy, never could remember his name. Ugh. He died right before the war, probably for the best. Continue. After he died, I decided to infiltrate a mining outpost. Destroy it from the inside. Down with capitalists and all that. Wasn't there too long before the bombs fell, which is how I changed. The outpost would later become Salt Town. After. After I turned into a ghoul, I joined the other miners and helped build up Salt Town. Wasn't too keen on it at first, you know, since I hate governments. But it grew on me, at least until we elected the first foreman. Never did like the guy, but things were still good. Then the second foreman took over and everything went to shit. I should add doesn't like governments to, uh, you know, my Tinder profile. The new guy was just as bad as the capitalist assholes from before the war. He may have been worse. He treated us like garbage, tools to make him richer. I joined a group to make things better. But they weren't willing to go far enough, so I left the town. Turned to scavenging after that, and here I am now. Alright. Okie dokie. Uh, what do you do for a living? I collect scrap and then sell it to places like Arlington. Places that have it rough. Do you live here? I know you don't, but do you live here? No, those meatheads just cornered me here. I don't live anywhere, really. I just walk the wastes. It's a good life, despite what you may think. Uh, the mine's gone, by the way. I uh, helped overthrow it, so if you want to go back. I heard. A few of my old friends from town came over to tell me. They didn't exactly have kind words for me, 
which was expected and deserved. It's going to be hard for all of them, the guards especially, but hopefully they'll see why we did this. Even if they don't, they're better off now than they were before. Thank you for doing this. It couldn't have been easy. You've earned this. Is that the Mad Merchant? Wait, what? The one and only. He managed to get out of the cave and find me. I don't know how, but I stopped questioning him a long time ago. Oh, is he here? I'm glad to finally have some company out here. I guess he is. What's gonna happen to Salt Town? I don't know. The town itself is done for, that's for sure. But the people... We'll have to wait and see. What will you do now? I'll keep traveling like before. I doubt anyone in Salt Town wants to see my face. All right, goodbye. Have a good life, kid. You too, Florence. Wait, where's the mad guy? Is he here? Bomb drops. Yo, Mad Hatter. All right, I don't think she gave us anything. I don't think she gave us anything. All right, I guess that's a a bug or something. Hey, there's uh, guns up here and an old clock. Coffee mug. Whoa, look at that, I did it. Ooh, look at that. Ooh, that's nice. Okay. Well, hello. Hello, goodbye. Later. Okay, I guess nothing's gonna attack us. I could have sworn like, Deathclaw was gonna come out and murder us, but let's go to church real quick, and then we'll go back. Ascension Church. Wow, this is a big ass church. Jeez. Got some uh, big heating bills. Daily Masal. Wait, do I eat it? Do I, do I eat the book? Maybe someone wanted this. I'm just too good at exploring. All right, now I, I want to check out this shack. Okay, then we'll go back. Got a lot of cool looking shacks, everyone. All right, it's garage. It's just another empty shack. Bombus. Bombus, you coming over here, Bombus? Look at them Bombus boys. Hey, Bombus. Bye, Bombus. Better call a fixer. You goofy Bombus. Robco prison facility. Oh God. Choir's key. Hmm. All right, this might be another undiscovered quest thingy. Just going to double check. Yeah, all right. All right, I'm going to leave my tank over here. I know, blasphemy. Hey, um, he was dead already? You take care of Marco? He was dead, kind of. He was dead when I got there. Really now? Yes, one of his raider friends decided to turn on him. You may not have killed him, but you are the one turning in the bounty, so you get the caps. Got an easier job for you. Raider by the name of Malin. Malin's been harassing people in the city with her pet wolves. One of them was a traitor who's put a bounty on her head. You know where this is going. Find her, kill her, and collect the reward. Any reason behind the attack? Maybe, who cares? When are you going to learn that you don't ask questions in this business? <laughs> you point and shoot, end of story. Sorry, man, sure. I knew you would. Bring me her knife once she's dead. Also, Wyatt, how is this easier than, um, finding a dead man? I mean, I guess if he was alive, but he, he, he was dead. All right, some ladies wolfing around. Actually, she's gonna get murdered by uh, 
We're not gonna have to do anything. This only does 55? Jeez. Gotta shoot, shoot the legs. Oh, is she, uh, alright, cool. Let's go talk to her first. Oh, God, she's gonna go after. Stop, stop, stop. I don't know what you're shooting at. Please stop. That's my associate. She is gonna help us. Malin? <laughs> Fresh meat? Good. The boys have been extra hungry today. Uh, there's a reason. Are your dogs okay? Who are you? You haven't heard of me. No. Really? Yes. I'm Malin, the bandit queen of Portland. And you're going to be doggy chow. Why are you attacking people? Because they made the mistake of wandering into my territory without paying. But if you're here for the bounty, it must be because I'm ramping up my attacks. I'm looking for someone, someone who should have died a long, painful death years ago. If I find the person, will you stop attacking people? You actually want to help me? You're not a typical bounty hunter, are you? Mm-mm. Huh. Well, if you really do care, the man I'm looking for is a merc named Donovan. Years ago, he and his merry band of murderers killed my parents. I've taken care of most of the gang, but Donovan's still out there. Bring him to me, and I'll dial back the attacks. Wait, dial them back? Why did he kill your parents? They were raiders. Not big time or anything, just scabs trying to make a living. Not that this stops someone from hiring Donovan to kill them. I don't know who hired Donovan, and I don't care. Donovan was the one who pulled the trigger. He's the only one that matters. Want me to bring his head? No. I want to kill him myself. Bring him to me, alive. I'll only do it if you stop the tax altogether. That's a big ask. Do you really expect the bandit queen of Portland, to give up her crown. Yes. God damn it. Yes? The bandit queen doesn't answer to anyone. Get them! Damn the space armor. You gonna kill me with a knife? God, you're stupid. Come on, doggies. I don't think your dogs care about you. Yeah, your dog, they don't give a Jameson. Sh get out of here, doggies. Come on, get out of here. Backpack guns. All right, well, I was gonna go talk to Donovan, but since she was a ding-dong, she did. Maybe in another playthrough. Uh, I can't believe, what do we, what do we have? Why do we have negative, I have withdrawal or something? No, it's because I have the helmet on. Ugh. Should I kill the wolves? Like, I mean, Prop, I guess so, right? Sorry. Oh God, shoot the legs. Sweep the leg, Johnny. Oh God, oh God. Holy shit! Jameson. <laughs> oh my god, where did you come from? Oh my god. <laughs> uh, Jolene, where are you? Let's get that science. Back here, uh, probably not gonna do the next one he gives us. You put Malin down. Oh, the Malins are down. Uh, where's Carla? Don't know. Word came in about what you did to Malin, and she vanished. 
Hope she's all right out there. Yeah, well, I was gonna... Was she Malin's lover? Stab the knife into the couch. Good going. I knew I could count on you. And this thing will make a nice addition to my collection. Your next job should be even easier than the last. Word is some crazy artist is kidnapping people and doing something to them. Vague. The families of the missing pooled their caps together to make this guy dead. That's where you come in. How many people have gone missing? Four we know of. But the way these things are, it's probably more. Hey, look at that. I rhymed. Did you? Uh, does the artist, does this artist have a name? The only ones who knew are the ones who disappeared. Hell, I don't even know what kind of artist he's supposed to be. Only that he has a camera. Where is he? Don't know exactly, but witnesses said he was going in the direction of Starborn Studios. I'd check there. All right. Unknown artist. All right. Uh, not gonna do... Yeah, we're not gonna do this one. Uh, you know what? Let's go to the Swordstone Tower. Let's do this one. And then after this, we'll probably just continue with the NCR. Ready, Jolene? Officer Voilez squad. Voilez. Visitor list. Files lost. That reporter guy keeps showing up, and I'm beginning to think he's interested in more than the deal with Robco. I'm just writing to ask what should be done. I know how much you dislike people looking into your private matters, and this guy seems the type. For now, I will just discourage him until you tell me to do otherwise. Okay. Let's go up. Oop, nope. Scrawled note. I was right. I knew there was some shade Jameson. down here, but even I couldn't have predicted just how insane it was. Now I have actual pictures as proof. They all laughed and said I was crazy, but now I'll show them. I'll turn into a skeleton. Ooh. It's dark. Okay. Uh-oh. Rituals. What the hell was that? <laughs> what was that? Keep picking the spooky quests. Ooh! Hey, listen. Wait, what? There's a key? Wait, where's the key? Oh my god, that's the key. Odd note. Lost my eyes today. They couldn't be believed. You should know, right? I, I, I guess. Hello? Ooh, a dragon. Officer. Whoa! Have we had... What? And another gun is added to my collection. That I may possibly drop. Where are you? Bull shotgun is a thousand times. Oh yeah, we've tried. We've used this. Oh, he's so quiet. Oh, it's a little baby quiet gun. All right, survivors. Hey there. I guess we could take their. Uh, let's take their dog tags. Whoa! Spooky Pants 5000. Oh my god. Grandpa, you're looking sexy. Let's go. Before the music crescendos. Corrupt that. Just coming through. My god. That's a lot of ammo. Um. Jesus Christ. Oh my god! <laughs> oh. 
Oh, he disintegrated. Robco acquisition. I can't believe it actually happened. We were finally acquired by Robco. It's the best thing that's ever happened to this company by far. And will allow the management to keep the lights on and let me keep my job. Only strange part is why would they buy us? Robco seems far above this local programming company. We can't possibly have much to offer them. I think somebody in the management must have just met House in a bar and talked him into saving us from the pit. Worry in. I'm sitting here trying to work my way into becoming employee of the month or at least get a promotion while everybody else is whispering about the Chinese and a nuclear war. It's honestly getting worrying. I just want to sit down and work to make management proud, not having to think about this theoretical apocalypse. Promotion! After all my hard work, I finally made employee of the month, and it comes with a promotion. Cafeteria even made me a cake to celebrate. Aren't they nice? Management wants me to come up and speak with them in person. To be completely honest, I don't think I've ever met somebody from management. Usually they just talk from the intercoms and speakers. Better be on my way up now. Unnamed. Did you know that neither Robco nor the employees of this building knew its true purpose? It could be called a place of worship. However, at this moment, it's a tomb. Your tomb, six. What about Jolene? Does she get to die here? Jeez. Oh, you brought me a candle. Thank you. Somebody's very nice. Okay. Let's let's keep going. Even though I want to poop. Oh, this is nice. This is awesome. Look at this place. This is a beaut. Oh, stuck behind couches. Very hard. Guess I should take my helmet off in case we have to do another speech check. Oh god. Here we go. Hmm. Hmm. Alright, we'll go in there in a second. chair. That's pretty nice. File room key. I used to be an officer, you know, in the great New California Republic, but I am above that now. Soon they will see that you used to be a courier as well. Oh. Okay. Oh, hey! Oh. That's not good. Alright, I'm guessing it was for this door. Oh, wait, no. Oh, upper floor. All right, let's go in here and get scared. Okay, I don't have to. Jesus Christ, Jolene. Oh. Jameson. The, oh, God. I think, a, I think someone was supposed to appear. Enable main power backup. Power redirection menu. Lucky 38 Portland. Backup generator. Oh, they're coming, courier. That's a rather stimulating exchange. All right. Jeez. Got some big boys here. Hey, could you make sure all the uh, backup lights are very red? Ooh. Hello? Whoa. Corrupted. You're different. You're not like the other girls. Hey. Jeez. 
halberd. Oh no, over encumbered. This looks like a combine. No, no, it's. All right, halberd. Oh, your hail broken. Hey, you actually. Here we go. The depths. Hmm. All right, let's uh, let's go upstairs. Actually, do we have any quest markers going on right now? They're coming. They're coming, Coria. They're coming. I'm gonna go in the other door. Oh. Wait, we're all my... God dang it. Oh, I gave her all my... I heard you survived the Matre, conquered Zion, claimed the big empty, walked the divide. You even went to New California. That might have been the other guy, though. What does it matter anyway? The key is to move forward. Oh, wow, it is. It is actually there. Come on down the hallways of death. I see you over there. Hi there. You shut your mouth. Sorry, Joey. Thought it was just a bit gonna be me, hmm? Yeah, you did. All right, let's go. All right, I gave her my uh, all the ammo for that Magnum by accident because I gave her the Jim Sterling gun. Oh. All right. If you're not gonna use the Sterling, let me adjust the gear in my Stop. Bag. Shut up. Make sure I shut up. Oh boy, five dollars. Boy. Whoa, look at all these notes I gotta read. It took me years to build this place to get the land, the materials to pay off the, d the workers so that they stay quiet. It is exactly as it was in my vision so many years ago, right to the last detail. Great monument for their return. I won't be able to keep this place up and running for very long, for it will cost me all of my wealth, but I should have enough time to break through. Henry Morningstar, Doe Mines. All this sacrifice and almost nothing has come from it. Nobody has been able to withstand their will. I've tried employees, officials, scientists, even people off the streets. Nobody has retained their mind yet. Am I doing something wrong? Henry. A little more time. Had to sell my corporate soul to house, the smug prick, to be able to keep this place running just a while longer. Fool knows nothing of the real power at play here. He just wants to steal my programs and use my power generators as a backup for his stupid casino. Such a waste. I suspect it won't be long before the authorities get involved as well. I already have reporters digging deeper than need be. I don't need the government digging as well. Assuming I succeed shortly, it won't matter anyway. The end is nigh. Had another vision, a terrible one. The end of the known world, not at their hands, but the hands of man. So I called in every last favor to help me and my few allies survive this apocalypse. My contact in the big mountain is sending me prototype gas masks, and I have also sent for rations to be sent to us. Food and water. We must persevere. The new apocalypse. The petty squabbles of man finally reached a breaking point today, October 23rd, 2077. In a way, this could be a good thing. My concerns with the law potentially busting down my doors is now a non-issue, and my generators will last until they are no longer necessary. New problem arises, though. Lack of people. If everybody was vaporized, how can our goal proceed? I know who I need. I had another vision. A vision of a man or a woman showing up at our doors. They must be the one. The one who will pull them back into this world. Problem is, I have no idea who they are exactly, and I have no idea of finding them if I did. So I must wait. Wait until they arrive. I will wait until the end of time if I must. Arrive he did. Mm. And you did arrive, courier, as did I. 200 years late, but who's counting? Mm. Much patience you must have. Mm. Nowhere to run, nowhere to hide. How to duty. Nowhere to run. Okay. Oh, triple pipe bomb. Listen before you lose ahead. Listen before you lose. Oh, a like your head. Listen. Oh no. You're also not like the other girls. I'm 
t take my drugs. Let's see, what do we got? Skills, speech 100. Eh, all right, we can talk our way out of this ghost. Hello? Hello? Man, we did all the spooky quests. Let's print a... Oh my god. I know these. I know these people, Jolene. It's the scary dudes. They're always trying to. Yeah, this. Oh, it's a. You know. You, you all know what's going on. Won't be long now. You're getting closer. Can you smell it? it? Smells like onions. All right, let's not let's stay above ground. Oh, this is terrifying. Jeez. I eat the bread. I eat the bread. My hands, they look like a bread. Got your scripture here. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, it's going through him. Whew. Thank you, Jolene. All right, whatever. Hey, was that another halbred? It was, halberd. This place is officially huge. All right, needs a key. Oh, I'm gonna pick this key up and die. Anti-venom, yeah. Old blueprints. All right. Oh no. We've gone back in time. Uh, all right. Let's go check that downstairs tunnel then. Oh, hey, Spooky Pants. Thanks for the food. Thanks, Spooky Pants. Oh, thank you. All right, so we went left. Go right. Get out of here. Oh. Okay, you don't have to tell me 14 times. Left. Oh. Someone's running. Oh, come on, shotgun. Why do you do that? Oh. Hey, did you have the gun? Magnum rifle snub nose. Alright. Alright, I'm good. Watch out, it's a little dangerous. More scripture. All right. All right, let's go. There's a lot of coffins. Hey. Hey. Ghost man. Oh, no. Are these the souls of everyone that he used? Uh-oh. What is reality anyway? Is this it? Getting harder to believe by the moment. Are you even the real courier? We got color back. Hey! Corrupted bones. Very nice. These bones were meant for breaking. Go here, dumbass. Oh, thank you. Save some for me. Okay, maybe kill that one. Oh god. Oh, it's a flamer. Okay. Oh, what happened? Oh, I can't see. Oh. Ugh. God, I hate poison. So stupid. Uh, is this the other side? Yeah, okay. My shotgun gonna slow the game down again? Alright. 
I don't know why it does that. It's been like a bug in the game. For as long as I can remember. Is this where the world? Whoa, this is creepy. Well, this is some megalophobia here. Megalophobia, it's the fear of like really big things. Oh! Like big schlongs? No, no. Not like big schlongs. God. Hey. Get out of here. You're the worst corrupted we've seen. Oh, he came back. Oh! Oh! Oh, Jolene, where are you? Oh, Jolene. Harpoon gun? That's another snub nose! God. Okay, I gotta switch this gun. Please let me switch. There you are. Question mark, maybe? This will be my last message I leave in the waking world for you, Courier. I've reached my own point of no return, this is yours. Let the blade guide you now, Officer of Viola. My god. The abyss. The abyssal edge. Excuse me? You're being used, Viola. They have no intention of helping you, I can assure it. Kind of gibberish you're even speaking. I sure hope killing you gets me out of this nightmare. You may wish your brain to put you into shock of heart. Um, yeah, you're being used. Mm -hmm. I serve something tangible and can foresee the future my choices will bring. Can you say the same? That's why I always take your helmet off. Stay away from you now, and I want. You should do what you think is right, Viola, but not blindly and not without question. It's over. Man. I will not do their bidding. You're tall. I wasn't thinking of the consequences. Only my new power. I'm sorry. I put the world at risk. That's okay. For nothing. It's okay. Played a very dangerous game, V. Yes, I'm aware. The things I could do with that power, they promised me more as well. In hindsight, I don't know why I believed them. 
I also realize that I can't risk anybody else making the same mistake. 6. If anybody asks about my whereabouts, or of this place, tell them that I am dead, and to stay away from here. I'll defend this building's secrets until the end of time. Is that what you really want? To stay here forever? It's not what I want. It's what I have to do now. 6. Thank you for saving me. Whoa. Damn. So did you pass out, Jolene, or did you see that? Oh, oh, some of the dust got in my mouth. Oof. Hey, there we go. The age and the corrupted mass. Look at this. Awesome. Let's see. Corrupted. Are you better than... Whoa, 86206? I do not believe you are. 86206 and Excalibur kicks your ass. Man, I really... The, the Abyssal Edge. Whenever the sword is drawn, it slowly drains your health, which you can regain by slashing enemies with it. Be careful with this thing. Oh, awesome. Hey, come over here. I just want... Give me your health. All right. <laughs> uh, and our apparel, Corrupted Mask, Night Vision. Ooh, everything looks mustardy. All right, awesome. Oh, I ate the egg. Oh, I was gonna, oh, I ate. That was supposed to be my baby chick child, okay. Whoops. Damn it, I ate my kid. All right. Oh. Well, that was nice, Jolene, right? That was, that was nice. All right, awesome. You know what, let's, uh, let's go find some enemies. Do some slashing. Stop running. Oh no, I can't stop running. What happened? God, I can't stop running. Stop running. I can't stop running. Come on, Wendigo. Like, actually knock me over. All right, that's not what I... Oh, oh, there it goes, okay. Well, I got my controls back. All right, Jolene, let me get one of them. Whoa. Whoa, hi there. All right, look at this health going up, hell yeah. Oh, no. Oh, the snow is coming down. Hey! Oh! Should have shot more. You should have shot more. Whoa! Okay. All right. I'm getting used to the uh, Magnum. I like it. Ooh, a homemade musket. Bombus meat. Go pee. Go pee? What? Oh. Bombus. Homemade musket? What the hell is this? Have we, tr have we uh... <laughs> I kind of, I kind of want this to explode in my hands. The red coats are coming. Oh. Pretty good. Okay, it doesn't, doesn't kill him, but pretty good. Jolene, how many people are you killing over here? Jeez. I also have enough money that 
picking up ammo doesn't always, you know, I don't have to pick up every piece of ammo. Hey, it's some wolves. Where are you going, wolf boy? Stop running. Oh, did that wolf go inside? Where'd he go? Oh. Um. Oh, oh crap, no, 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 not like this. You, you, you there! Propagate! Stop! Um. Oh, oh. Yeah, yeah, you! Fight me to the death, Propagate! And who are you? Why would I tell you? Well, I'm a Granger anyways. I'm a Legion recruit, if you couldn't tell. Not a good one, mind you. Uh. It's okay, Granger. You trying to fight me with a stick? I mean, you have a gun on your back, but uh, it looks like you're holding a stick. It's a spear, Profligate. Come on, give me a break. I'm trying my hardest here. <sighs> Okay, yeah, it's just a stick. You're really pathetic. Wow, that's just cold. I'm kinda in a bad situation right now. What else am I supposed to do here, wise guy? Wouldn't happen to be that collar, would it? Yes, I don't know how it got on me. I assume I was drinking again. Are you able to get it off? Please. I know you're in CR and whatever, but please, I'll desert the Legion if you just let me out. Um, all right, sweet. Set off the collar intentionally. Here, let me press this button. I'll, hmm, let me try opening it. I know a thing or two about lock picking. Leave your own devices. Yeah, here we go. Wow, <laughs> you work fast. Thank you so much for that. Whew. I'm going to try to find a place to stay now. Wait, you still have the bomb on your bomb. Granger. All right, well, best of luck, buddy. You seem a little cold. <coughs> Groovatron. I'll let him, I'll look away so he gets further. Oh, no, he's, okay, still there. All right, let's go back to the NCR. Skitters. All right, we'll get to Skitters eventually. We're going back to the NCR. <laughs>